Families say plastic looking materials floating on the surface of a local lake and they want to know what it is. Yeah, new at 5, Action News Jack's Beth Rousseau headed out on Lake George to find out if the water is safe for the people who live there in Putnam County. Dwayne Cobble says he's seen algae in the water before, but what he's never seen is this plastic like material floating on the top. Dwayne Cobble has been fishing in Putnam County for decades. He says he noticed something different while out on Lake George Monday. I saw all the floating debris. It looked like plastic in the water, and it concerned me. Cobble took these pictures of what he says was on the surface of almost 100 acres of the lake. He sent the photos to the Action News Jack's newsroom. I was concerned for people's health, people swimming, people boating, and people fishing and eating the fish. Today, I went out on Cobble's boat. This is what we found, the same substance in the water. He says it seems to be moving up the St. Johns River towards Jacksonville. When you start dealing with fish and, and uh, pollution, you got to be very careful. I sent pictures to the St. Johns River keeper who forwarded them to the St. Johns River Water Management District. A spokesperson tell me several scientists have looked at the photos and it's hard to discern what the material is. I think that as a safety issue, we'd at least like to know what it is. Is. I'm learning what's being done to take care of this. I'll have that all new on Action News Jacks at 6. Reporting in Putnam County, Beth Russo, CBS 47, Action News Jack.